Hi everyone, welcome back again. Few days back on my Instagram, I had posted about my son winning for a badminton tournament. It was conducted outside Riyadh, not in the city. So only my husband and Rihan had gone for it. I and Arman was back home just because we were not sure if women were allowed inside to watch the tournament. But later we came to know it was allowed. Um, and moreover, I had few editing works to be done, so we were back home. Now they had gone on Friday and came back the next day. So just a vlog on Friday to let you know how I and Arman spent that day at home. Actually, I wanted to make Arman do the voiceover, but it was an utter failure, so I had to take over. Now I didn't want to spend too much time cooking or cleaning because he would be all alone. So at first I thought I'll order food from outside, but then later decided to ask him if he could help me in the kitchen, and he was really very excited. So some of his very simple favorite dishes with his help. Hope you like it. Keep watching. Arman had already woke up before me. He wasn't really happy when I asked him to come for a shower. Here the climate is really very dry and winter is approaching so it was very necessary for applying moisturizer on their body and face every time after shower. Now on their body I use Cetaphil body moisturizer and for the face it's Sebamed. After the shower, he began to play some games. Meanwhile here, my husband was packing his and Rihan's dress. I love to massage their head and they love it too. Arman was a little upset as Rihan took over the games. But later when he realized they were leaving, he was completely happy that it would be all his own. Wishing him all the best. They had planned to have breakfast with others who were going along for the tournament. So preparing breakfast for Arman. He loved crepes. Now I'm not that perfect in making pancakes and crepes but my kids love the way I make. I add one banana to a blender. Then goes one cup of milk. Two tablespoons of all-purpose flour. pinch of salt, one egg and then blend. Okay. 
adding some ghee or butter to the pan adding a big spoon of the batter and then swirl covering and cooking it in very low flame Turning to the other side and cook for another couple of minutes. You can add some honey but here I'm going for chocolate syrup. He is back to the game again. Now it's my breakfast time. Just two slices of bread dipped in some gram flour and spice mixture. He just simply wanted to change the trousers. Now I am going for a hair massage for myself with my homemade hair oil. I have already done a video on it. Do click the i card above or the link is there in the description box. Now I don't use my dishwasher all the time only when I am in a hurry or when I am lazy. Many of you had suggested me to use gloves when I clean the dishes with my hand. It was really uncomfortable in the beginning but now I feel it's a lot more better and can see my hands not as dry as earlier. Now for lunch making a quick kapsa with this ready made spice mix from Maggi. This can be also used for couscous, pasta and many others. Since Arman loves rice I am making kapsa. The instructions are given behind. There is another recipe inside too. Now into a bowl as per the instructions I am adding 2 cups of rice that's basmati rice
Now I just didn't want him to touch the non wedge, so I'm cleaning it myself. I'm using four thighs here. I know. Mm. Now heat a pan in which you'll be making the kapsa. Add some vegetable oil or ghee for extra flavor. Add the chicken pieces and fry till they change the color. Now into a mixing bowl, add 1 tablespoon of tomato paste. Then the spice mix. Then goes 4 cups of water. Mix well. Now after the chicken has changed its color, add the water mix and let it boil. Once the water boils, add the washed and drained rice. Just a mix. Now some poses by that time. Now when the rice is boiling, keep it on very low flame for 25 minutes or until the water is dried up. Meantime, I made him do some homework. The water is dried up by this time. Off the flame. Just a mix. And keep it as such for 5 to 10 minutes more. Quickly aside for the rice, 2 tablespoons of curd, 2 tablespoons of mayonnaise, 1 teaspoon chaat masala and mix well. Add some salt and it's ready. Now he's watching his favorite movie and trying to imitate a dance in that. As he woke up very early in the morning, he was feeling sleepy. So a nap was very necessary for keeping him active for the rest of the day. After he slept, I moved on to my works. I don't edit on laptop, I do it completely on my phone but I try to check mails and reply to all of your comments on laptop just that I don't strain too much looking close to the screen. Now I'm planning to change my editing on laptop because mobile editing is too much strain for the eyes nowadays. While he was asleep, I made a masala chai for me.
Don't know why, but he woke up very soon. Trying some chicken nuggets for him. Many of you had asked me some air fryer recipes as well as a review for it. I shall be doing soon a video on that. Now for dinner I had bought a frozen pizza the previous day so I am preparing that. The rice I had made for lunch was enough but I kept it in the fridge for the next day. The instructions are given on the packet. Pizza. Mm. Just a quick cleaning. This is the outfit he loves to be in all the time. Final treat was the ice cream. Okay. Okay, Added some cookies crushed. Mm -hmm. 
welcome. Time for a shower. Then for a good night's sleep. So that ends today's vlog. Hope you all, especially my little Arman fans, enjoyed watching this video. See you all with another video. Until then, take care. Bye bye.